Incorporating this visually appealing and practical rotating transition effect into your slides is sure to captivate your audience. The process of creating this effect is both engaging and straightforward, comprising a combination of picture backgrounds, gradient masks, rotating wheels, and text elements. Are you ready? Let's dive into creating it together. Let's start by setting up the background. Begin by inserting the prepared image and cutting it to the clipboard using Ctrl plus X. Right-click, navigate to set the PPT background, choose Picture or Texture Fill, select Clipboard, and voila, your background is now set to the prepared image. To enhance the texture of the image, let's add a gradient mask. Insert a rectangle, resize it to match the page dimensions, remove its outline, and apply a gradient fill. By default, there are four stops in the gradient. We need to eliminate the middle two stops. Select black for both stops. Set the left stop to 100% opacity and the right stop to 30% opacity. Adjust the position of the first stop to around 20%. This sets up our background perfectly. The next crucial step involves creating the rotating wheel element. During the transition animation, the larger circle rotates counterclockwise, while the smaller circle inside rotates clockwise, creating a visually stunning effect. The wheel element comprises shapes from flowchart elements, circles, and textual titles. Within the shapes, locate the flowchart options and insert a circle as the central wheel element. Resize it while holding Shift ensuring the center axis is slightly to the right of the page. Next, configure the shape settings. Set the shape to slide background fill, outline to white with a thickness of one point, and add a right-sided shadow with a size of 103 and a blur of 12. Insert text elements in a clockwise order, placing them with attention to detail to avoid errors. Add another circle as the central wheel. Set its background to slide background fill, remove the outline, and apply the same shadow effect as the flowchart circle, with a size of 103 and a blur of 12. To complete the wheel setup, group the text and flowchart circles excluding the middle circle. This ensures they rotate together in the same direction during the transition. The third step involves the rotation effect. Duplicate the current slide, change the background of the subsequent slide to the prepared image, and rotate the elements accordingly. The flowchart should rotate counterclockwise by 90 degrees to align the next slide's title horizontally. Rotate the inner circle clockwise by 45 degrees. Select both slides and apply the Morph effect in the transition options to witness the rotation effect seamlessly. Continue this process for subsequent slides, adjusting the angles of rotation for both the flowchart and inner circle to maintain the visual continuity of the animation. The final step involves adding text elements. Position the corresponding text on each slide to animate the text as the slides transition. On the first slide, copy and place the text from the second slide below the visible area of the slide. On the second slide, move the text from the first slide above the visible area and copy the text from the third slide below the visible area. Repeat this process for subsequent slides, ensuring the text from the preceding slide is placed above the next slide and the text from the subsequent slide is positioned below the preceding slide. Lastly, enhance the transition by incorporating a gear sound effect. Download the sound effect from a free website as noted in the video description below. Convert the sound effect to WAV format if necessary and apply it to all slides under the sound settings in the transition options. Preview the presentation to witness the visually captivating and engaging rotating transition effect you've created. If you appreciate this effect, feel free to experiment with it yourself. Remember to subscribe to my channel for more exciting content.